everyone. So two minutes on grave decorations. So here in my area last year, the year before, there was a huge uproar because there was a local cemetery that had gone through and thrown out flowers and trinkets and stuff that people had left on gravestones. However, how over the top were they what they left? You know, cemeteries are made to be able to also efficiently mow and care for. So if you get too much stuff around gravestones, headstones, you can't efficiently take care of the cemetery. It goes back to that old, you know, taxpayers don't want to pay, people don't want to pay, you don't want to pay to take care of a space, but you want it well taken care of. So how is that supposed to happen? And then when you add more stuff around a headstone that slows down mowing and all of that, it's hard. However, then on the other side, you argue, but it's our headstone, it's our space. We want to put things there for our loved ones. Those are important to us. That's where we remember them. So who wins in that? Because you have to kind of balance both sides. So the one cemetery has now said nothing is allowed, not even small flowers, not even anything, because the people who were over the top kind of ruined it for the people who were trying to leave just a little bit of stuff. Just like memorial parks where they had super big restrictions on what you can leave. You can't just leave stuff on the grave. You have to have one of those special vases to put flowers in. So what over the top things, or I guess it's appropriate for some people, um, things have you seen left on headstones or grave markers that you thought were too much or really cool, you know, the solar lights or the coins that people leave or uh, alcohol bottles, all sorts of things that people leave out on gravestones. Should that be left to accumulate or can people pick them up and keep the cemetery tidy? What do you guys think about all that and what are some things you've seen or you have left on headstones?